Hey guys, even here, and this is Brion Ainsley right here, and we're watching his posing routine from the Mr. Olympia Finals. And Brion was at his 100%. He couldn't have been any better. As he said, he worked his hardest for this prep. He brought his best edition ever. And he cannot get any better than this. This is pretty much... He worked super hard for this Mr. Olympia. He said that he never worked so hard for any competition in his life. I watched some of his vlogs and he was really suffering. He really gave it all of his. And he was pretty much convinced. He was very confident. He was pretty sure that he's going to win the Mr. Olympia once again. Everybody thought so. I thought so. I was pretty convinced. I was 90% sure. I was 90% sure, but it didn't happen. He lost. He lost. And uh, consider this. He was the champion for the last two years. This year, he brought his best package ever. Everybody thought that he's going to win it. He was more muscular than Chris, he had better back, better legs, probably better conditioning, overall more complete physique, but the judges simply told him, you don't have the best structure, you don't have the best lines. That is something he can never change. He cannot come more conditioned than this, how much more can he get conditioned? This is, this is perfect conditioning. Look at those biceps, look at the peaks on his biceps, that's something that Chris doesn't have. Look at the back, that's something that Chris also doesn't have. The thickness of the glutes, of hamstrings and everything. He was perfect, as much as he can be. But the judges told him he doesn't have the structure. Now the question is, will he compete ever again? Because I don't think it would really make much sense. The only way that he could beat Chris is if Chris is off. So the only way that he can beat him is to hope that Chris comes off. Because nothing else he can do. He cannot come better than this. And Brian is not a youngster. Chris is 24. Brian is like 40. He's 39, 40 probably right now. This year, this year at Mr. Olympia, we saw the best package that Brian was possibly able to bring. This is the best Brian ever. And this is him at his 100%. Conditioned and full. And still wasn't enough to beat Chris. So apparently he doesn't have the structure. So that's it. Do you think Brion will ever compete again in Classic? Do you think he deserved this victory? Do you think he was robbed? Well, you cannot really think that because you don't really know what is the judging criteria because it's not bodybuilding. Judging criteria is different in physique divisions. They're looking for a physique, not for a bodybuilder. Comment section, anyways, what is your take? Also, don't forget to like the video and to subscribe to my channel for more Mr. Olympia updates and all kinds of bodybuilding uploads. Thank you very much guys for watching. All the best. Bye-bye.